are new to my channel, my name is Ashley. If you've been here before, welcome on back, family. I just want to start off by apologizing that this Wednesday tour vlog is not out on time. It's dropping today on a Thursday. So sorry, you guys. It's just been a week. I am touring the luxury apartments called the Plaza in San Mateo. So excited to see what this place has to offer. If you don't know, the mall is down the street, Safeway's down the street, Home Depot, Target. Everything you would need is near this place. And right across the street is a nice coffee tea spot. State Farm is right there. A spa for your hair care is all right there as well. And a sandwich spot. Right across the street is a beautiful grass area. Playground for kids as well. So it's just a really quiet, beautiful neighborhood that still has everything you would look for without having to get on the freeway. Whenever places are like that, it's chef's kiss to me. So. Very excited to be touring this place. If you are too, make sure you like this video, give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and let's jump right on into this tour. Straight ahead in that corner, that is the parking garage, you guys. We're going in the leasing office right over there. Coming right on in, our kitchen is to the right, and I love that it looks pretty spacious and it's very open, so no walls around us anywhere. Always makes the space look way more open. Dishwasher is right here. Standard dishwasher does look a little bit older. This is our sink. It's not as deep as I would like it to be. Ooh, I do like the water pressure though. Great water pressure. Of course it has a detachable head. Y'all know me, I always like to see how much space is underneath my sinks because all my cleaning supplies are going to go in here for my kitchen. Deep long drawers. Ooh, guys, my favorite types of cabinets when they go longer than you expect them to. Okay. So I love this. Easy for me to put pots and pans, both sides, multiple drawers. We have cabinet space on both sides, which I love because again, you always have to think where are your plates, your bowls, your cups, different things going to go. And then of course we have a set of cabinets above the microwave, above the fridge. This kitchen has a lot of cabinet space. So I am a happy girl. I am not the biggest fan of gas stoves, but a lot of units are coming with them. Standard microwave. Let's go check out our fridge. This freezer feels huge to me. Fridge is a good, decent size as well. I am a sucker. My home is like this now with the dark chestnut cabinets and then the white countertops. I love the contrast between them. Don't know why, it's just so beautiful to me. Leak tan wall, lots of outlets for me to use. But yeah, that is our kitchen. So far, I love it. Super spacious, very airy. Can we admire all this countertop space? It is beautiful. I can have a big setup right here. Like I really wanna get a stand to show different holidays and stuff and it'd be so perfect to be right here. My coffee station, everything could be spread out and not clutter my countertops. And I'm so happy about that. that Wow, chef's kiss. And then I love the lights, of course, on the top as well. Very dainty and delicate. Resetting coming in. This would be my living room slash dining room area. This is a bit hard for me to imagine because I have a long L-shaped couch. So I'm thinking this wall right here, right? TV, probably mounted. L-shaped couch is gonna be angled interestingly. Ooh, I'm thinking couch starts by the window actually. So there and then long part here, TV right there, and would have to do, that's my stuff, sorry, but have to do some bar stools here. But it's there is no way I can get a table in here to eat for a dining room because it is so snug and small here. Yeah, and I don't want it to look too smush. So no dining room table, so I don't like that necessarily. Turning right around. Ooh. 
coat closet, but you guys see that? It goes in long, wow, didn't expect that. I like that a lot. I'm assuming washer and dryer must be in here, which it is, you guys know how I feel. I love newer washer and dryers. Let's see how big, oh, oh I do this every time. Oops, <laughs> pretty long, or pretty, pretty deep. Yeah, pretty deep inside, all right. I like that a lot. This looks smaller though, y'all see that? Interesting. All right, this is our small hallway. The left is the bathroom, the right is the master bedroom. Oh, see some lights. Hello. All right, I love this huge mirror. The lighting is great as well. We have the traditional medicine cabinet. I am a fan of the sink countertop space. I can have a cute setup here. Our toothbrushes, water flossers can be out and not overcrowd the sink. Water pressure is weak. I don't like that part. Three drawers, not horrible. And we got a little bit of space underneath for again, cleaning products and toilet paper. Other stuff I'd wanna put for bathroom storage. This is our toilet. It's like a pretty good sturdy toilet. We have a rack for toilet paper, another rack for towels. And guys, look how deep that tub is. So we have a bathtub shower combo and I told you a lot of one bed, one baths do not come with that. So I'm blown away and they gave us a few shelves in here for soaps and then you don't have to get a shower curtain if you do not want to get one. I haven't seen one of these in a long time. So I'm kind of excited they have a glass door to close. But yeah, pretty spacious bathroom, a little fancy with our hand towel right here. That's our bathroom. Turning right around, we are greeted with our master bedroom. You guys see how awkwardly shaped this bedroom is? I kind of like it though. So bed would of course go right there. And then on the side would be our nice stands, of course. TV would definitely have to be right here mounted. Hopefully the door does not hit it. And then turning around, ooh, my husband is freaked out by glass doors. Just so you guys know, like glass closet doors. So he would hate this. But I love that they built us some shelves on the inside, but still a small closet, but they're trying to make the best out of the situation for us. So we have some drawers here, hanging space right here. Some more hanging space. And then of course at the top, we can put shoes or other things we want to store. Before we exit this apartment, we do have a little balcony that you would be able to enter in and from, from only the master bedroom. Guess this is our AC unit. And then I have a nice view of the pool, sauna. And then I guess you can have cabanas, which is really nice. And I can see the grill area from here. These are good so that birds don't come chill on your balcony, but I'm such a bird person. I would be like, can I take this down please and feed my beautiful friends? <laughs> All right, beautiful people, that is our first apartment that we've toured at the plaza. We are going to move on to our next apartment and then move on to our amenities. So let's get going. I'm so excited to see what else this place has to offer. This elevator is right outside of the parking structure, which I love. These are what parking spaces look like. So you get a parking spot that comes with your unit for free. So there are multiple grilling areas in this complex. This is one of them. And then it's a little patch of grass over there for doggies to go use the potty. He's cleaning the pool right now. They're very beautiful. I have found the fitness center. This is what it looks like. It is equipped with a good amount of equipment and weights, barbells, balls, free weights. They go pretty high too for free weights. Got some cables over here. This gym is pretty well equipped. It's probably one of the best I've seen. Nima's was amazing. Nima's has the best gym, hands down. But this is a close runner up for having a lot of stuff. Do you guys have a Stairmaster? Nope, but that's okay. They have a lot of stuff though. Very impressed with this gym. Cleaning wipes as well. No bathrooms in here though, so that's a downfall. You have some cubbies, water, trash. Beautiful people, hello. We are done checking out that spot. Y'all, my eyes are 
it's so hot today my eyes are like swelling i could not take you guys into the clubhouse but it didn't look like anything crazy had a pool table pretty small area it was right next to the pool but the fob didn't allow me to get in i hope you guys enjoyed touring the plaza with me though it is a luxury apartment that sam and Tell has to offer thank you for joining me on this tour day wednesday i hope you guys enjoyed it and comment down below what was your favorite part of this apartment i thought we were going to see another one but they don't have availability for two bed two baths right now for what i'm looking for or for different one bed one bath plans it was only that one so unfortunately we were limited but see you guys in the next vloggy vloggy vlog bye